This is a bench test of the Pentair Superflow Variable Speed Pump, where we will be monitoring the flow rates and electrical consumption for this pump with this specific plumbing configuration, which is two suction lines and one return line. On the suction side, we have a two inch line and an inch and a half line meeting together at a two inch suction manifold. The pressure side of the pump is a single inch and a half pipe. Let's go ahead and get started here. Pump is running at 750 RPM. Current electrical consumption, 0.88 amps, about 92 watts. Our flow rate is just about 14 gallons per minute. At 1000 RPM, we have just over one amp of electrical draw and 134 watts of power consumption. Our flow is now approaching 20 gallons per minute. We're about 18, maybe just a shade over 18 gallons per minute. At 12.50, we have 1.17 amps of draw, 188 watts. Our flow rate now is hovering just under 30 gallons per minute, about 28 gallons per minute. At 1500 RPM, we have 1.42 amps, 264 watts. It's about 36 gallons per minute. We have now 1.81 amps, 372 watts. It's about 43 gallons per minute. At 2000 RPM, we have 2.38 amps, 513 watts, 514 watts. We are now just about 50 gallons per minute. Three point one two amps, six hundred and ninety two watts. That's about fifty seven gallons per minute. Four point zero five amps, nine hundred and fifteen watts. That's about
about 64 gallons per minute. Five point two seven amps, one point two kilowatts, or one thousand two hundred watts. That's about seventy gallons per minute. thousand rpm we have 6.63 amps 1.51 kilowatts we're seeing about 76 77 gallons per minute amps 1.9 kilowatts that's about 85 gallons per minute This is maximum speed. Nine point eight eight amps, two point two six kilowatts. That's about ninety six or ninety seven. Actually, sorry, let's look, let's take a look at that again. Make sure I got that right. Sorry, that is 90 to 92. 92 gallons per minute. As a reminder, this bench test has two suction lines, one two inch line and one inch and a half line that meet in a two inch suction manifold into the pump. On the discharge side, we have a single inch and a half line. The electrical service for the pump is 240 volts for this test. If you found this information helpful, please be sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And you can check out my website, swimmingpoolsteve.com.